but that, that thing's gonna tumble. And uh, it happens fairly often here near Battle Harbor. So we just get an uh, opportunity to see that as you take the ferry from uh, the mainland out to the island to see the National Historic Site. The people in these local communities, not only Battle Harbor, but in all these villages that surrounded Battle Harbor, totally depended on these merchants here for, for their survival. So this was sort of their, their only place on the coast that they could come and get provisions. So the merchants would have to stock enough freight here in the, in the summer and fall to get all these villagers through the winter. As you can see from this vantage point here in Battle Harbor, you can see four or five icebergs within a, with just within a couple of miles. Now, people use these boats in the summertime to, uh, to row across the, the harbor here and they tie up on the other side and then they go for a hike you know, over the hills. They come back, they get in the little row boats and they row back to the site again. So that's just uh, something that we provide for our, uh, our guests here. Oh, well, I can take people out there at sea out in my boat and we can see orca whales, we can see humpback whales, we can see fin whales, we can see the large skulls of harp seals that frequent these waters. What else can you do? Oh, well, well you can go berry picking, you can go hiking over the islands, there's traditional footpaths here, there's abandoned villages that you can visit. Kind of a mix of casual, relaxed, and adventure in between. Yeah. We like to do a lot of historical trips, so to check out places that, you know, have a long history and have a lot of people there, things going on. This was just totally met our expectations and also the fact that you were on an island isolated. You really got a feeling of what it was like. Definitely an Ort, wo man hinkommen sollte. Echt eine Erfahrung, wo man einfach ein paar Tage ausspannen kann, die Erfahrung, die man in Europa sicher nicht mehr machen kann. Should people come to Battle Harbor? It is probably one of the single most interesting sites along the east board, eastern seaboard to visit right now, I believe, along with Red Bay. There's a lot to be learned. It's rich. Uh, the interpretation is very, very good. And the process of getting there is an experience as well that I think is meaningful to people. Oh, for just one time, I would take the Northwest Passage to find the hand of Franklin reaching for the Beaufort Sea, tracing one warm line through a land so wild and savage, and make the Northwest Passage to the sea.